All right, all right, all right. Hey, YouTube, I'm Lucky, and I have a bit of a drama news story that has to be covered today. A Bungie dev actually threatened to stop the Threads of Light fashion show competition if the replies and responses on Twitter don't stop being so toxic. Yes, you heard me right. This is what we have from a Bungie dev right here. We have uh, Griffin here who posts, uh, if the reaction to these spotlights continues to be toxic and negative while putting down others' creations, We'll stop doing these altogether. Be better. And now this is uh, retweeting the post from Destiny the Game saying dress to thrill. And they show the Threads of Light winners. They have a bunch of different armor sets and they look great. And obviously, you know, art is subjective. Fashion is subjective. But a lot of people had a bunch of toxic responses. He goes on to also say fashion is art. Taste is subjective. Imagine coming into the replies and insulting someone's art. Mind bogglingly inappropriate. Now, you might be thinking, well, what were the replies like? Was it really that bad? And it is. It is really that bad. It's actually pretty crazy to see how toxic the community gets. But no surprises because Twitter is a true cesspool of toxicity. It feels like the more toxic you are on Twitter, the more attention you get. And so the toxic people get more attention. So then they choose to be even more toxic. And it goes on and on and on. It's a negative cycle that never ends on Twitter. And I do feel like uh, a bungee dev actually saying that if they don't stop being toxic to this, that they're going to cancel the show altogether, will only fuel the flames, all right? You never want to tell the toxic people that they have power, because as soon as they feel like they have some sort of power or that they are getting at you, then they're just going to keep going at you twice as hard. So uh, definitely a misstep, in my opinion, from this Bungie dev. But we will go over the replies here, and I'll show you uh, what was being said that was so toxic. Obviously, a lot of people deleting replies, getting blocked, getting put in the like suspended section when you you know say things that are just really horrible. So we're not going to read any of that because some of that's pretty terrible. But one of the top responses we have here says, really, those are the best that you found with 136 likes. So obviously a lot of people, you know, agreeing with the sentiment and not liking the selections, the fashion selections for the Titan, the Hunter, and the Warlock and thinking, thinking that they're not very good. Along with that, it seemed like everyone decided to either put down uh, other people's fashion or use it as a stepping stool to promote theirs because they're just so much more fashion like in taste and everyone their fashion is so much better than everyone else's we just see so many responses like this over and over again this person says they're lucky i didn't submit my style that hunter has nothing on me and you know whether this is sarcastic or joking whatever it may be they're basically just putting down the other people's fashion and trying to use it to launch themselves in their own look and say that they look a lot better than the Hunter, Titan, Warlock. And then obviously the responses go on and on and on on so many of these responses. I mean, I could pull up another one here. It says, ah, good job, guys. Truly thought my Titan would have been a contender. Again, you know, just try and take it in a moment to just show their fashion. And then on the next one, we have congrats to all. Titan looks the best. But I, of course, have to say I look amazing. Now, obviously, you know, saying congrats to all is nice. I don't think that there's uh, toxic connotations meant from this necessarily. But you do take a moment to be like, well, I do look better, though, you know. And when you do that, the replies end up being pretty toxic over and over and over again. We saw that from that post. And so there you have it. That is the bit of Destiny drama. If the toxicity doesn't stop, apparently they're going to literally end the threads of light. So if you're out there trying to submit your fashion, make sure to support those, okay? If you don't win the competition, if you put in your uh, entry and you lost, it's okay. Just enter again another time. It's not a big deal. Support those that did win. Congratulate them. Show them some love because, you know, this is a cool competition. And if you don't uh, show some positivity towards this, it is going to come to an end, quite literally. So... That's a wrap on this drama story. And if you want to stay up to date on all things Destiny 2, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe with notifications on. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Later.